Lloyd Mayweather has already held world titles at 130, 135, 140. He was given a title belt as the result of his win over Judah because Judah still had one unaccountably. So even though he's held a title belt at 147, that's purely a statistical technicality. He hasn't been the champion of this division yet. Well, in his own mind, he's the champion of every division, past, present, and future. He's uh, the kind of performer who walks around like uh, there's a band following him. You know, if he was a peacock, he'd never fold his feathers. In his own mind, this pound-for-pound -pound title is bigger than the welterweight title that Valdemir holds. Well, and I think, frankly, fans are so confused by the panoply of belts in every division that many of them now pay more attention to the unofficial pound-for-pound -pound ranking to identify who are the real stars in the sport. And incidentally, Floyd always says, Emmanuel, that this is a gladiator's sport and now I know why he said it so many times leading into this fight. Well, he's quite a showman, and I, I like the fact that even though he's wrapped up in all of his ego and all his other things he's doing, he still has trained properly for this fight. But other than that, I would actually favor Balamir to beat it, well, except I know he's prepared himself you know, very well. Floyd shows up, shows off, and usually stops the show. And incidentally, that shield is no giant exaggeration of the Mayweather body. Because yesterday, when he stepped onto the scales at the weigh-in, he looked way more like Roy Jones than ever before. A deeply muscled chest now, a rippled belly a la Jones, and rest assured that Floyd, who is something of a narcissist, who says that he takes a shower before he works out, is tremendously proud of the way he looks. that proud of the way he looks, maybe he should have foregone all of this kitschy showbiz stuff and showed us what he looks like. Well, eventually we're going to get a chance to see. One thing, 